And now it's time to head to the beach. Today's first hottie is a student named Amanda, and she is very concerned with the community. Her lifelong dream is to graduate and eventually become a notary public. Steve, I don't know which community she's in, but I would love to be sentenced to some community service with her. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get it? Community service. I'm a community health major. Community health. Yes. What does that mean? I'm going. I guess I'm health education. All right, that puts it. That's. I understand it okay. now. Okay. Okay. All right, Amanda. I have some trivia questions for you. Are you pretty smart? Uh, we'll have to find out. We'll find out right now. Okay. Our next contestant is Katie, and she loves to drink beer. She drinks a lot of beer. I tell you, Steve, I don't know where she puts it all. Except maybe in her tits. Hi, Katie. How are you? Good. Where are you from? I'm from Texas A&M. What do you study at A&M? Speech communications. Speech communications. All right. Okay. That's a good major. Yes. Yeah. Finally today, Dick, we have our third competitor, the double team of Brittany and Tony, a couple of college girls who couldn't be more excited to be here. Steve, these girls have the intensity and the total enthusiasm that can go a long way in this game. Plus, they're willing to flash. All right, ladies, where are you from? Port Dutchess Groves, Texas. All right, what do you do there? Nothing. <laughs> you don't do anything there? No, we're students at Lamar University. <laughs> That's great. I've never even heard of that college. No one okay. The question is, what hockey player's nickname is Super Mario? Oh. Super Mario. I have no earthly idea. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sorry. The answer is Mario Lemieux. Mario Lemieux. You ready? One, two, three. I'm ready. You ready? The question is, Katie, during a leap year, what month gets an extra day? February. The correct answer is February. Nice job. The question is, the president is the head of which of the three branches of government? The executive. The correct answer is executive. Hell yeah. You guys are doing great. All right, here's the question, Amanda. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. I want you to name the wheelchair bound scientist who wrote the book A Brief History of Time. Uh, I don't know that. <laughs> you want to take a guess? Um, I really don't know. Okay, the correct answer is Stephen Hawking. Okay. okay. Well, you ready? One, two, three. <laughs> okay, the question is Louis Armstrong. A pioneering member of the jazz scene is known for blowing on what? The saxophone. I'm sorry, the correct answer is trumpet. He played the trumpet. All right. Are you ready? One, two, three. All right. Here is the question, ladies. In terms of land area, what is the world's largest city? Mexico City. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. The correct answer is Tokyo, Japan. Tokyo, Japan. Are you ready? On three, ladies. One, two, three. <laughs> nice job. Okay, let's go. Okay, here's the question. The best man's primary function at a wedding reception is to do what? Uh, I guess give the ring to the, um, the groom so he can... I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Uh, he has to toast the groom at the reception. Are you ready? One, two, three. All right. All right, here's the question. Long before Sex in the City, Sarah Jessica Parker gained fame and notoriety as a cast member of what 80s coming of age sitcom? It's a TV show in the 80s, kind of a sitcom thing. She was on it. She played a high school student. Uh, girls just want to have fun? No, I'm sorry. Jill. Girls just want to have fun is incorrect. That was a movie that she was in, but the correct answer is Square Pegs. She was on Square Pegs. Are you ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Katie. Here's the question. Richard Branson is the chairman of what corporation? I have no, I don't know. He's a British guy. 
a British guy? BBC. I'm sorry, the BBC is incorrect. The correct answer is Virgin Atlantic. I want to hear a lot of noise, guys. On, on three. One, two, three. Oh. All right. The question is, what European monarch has reigned the longest? Uh, hold on just a second. European monarch? European king. European king. I narrowed it down for you. It's a king. Uh, I'm not a really... Charles. Sure, Charles. It was not Charles. It was Louis the Fourteenth. Are you ready? One, two, three. Okay, sorry. It's okay. It's okay. You look great. Oh, thank you so much. You I'm, and I are going to get I'm feeling great. You look great. You really thank do. Thank you so much. Okay. All right, on the NBC show Frasier, all right, mm -hmm. Frasier's father is retired from what profession? <laughs> I don't know. A mortician. <laughs> I'm sorry, mortician is incorrect. The correct answer is police officer. You ready? One, two, three. <laughs> what U.S. city sells the most blonde hair dye? Los Angeles. I'm sorry, both of those answers are incorrect. It's Dallas, Texas. Most blonde hair dye in the world. One, two, three. All right, ladies, go to.